Hey everybody, so today we're going to be showing you the tutorial on the TBS Crossfire Transistor Mod. And to do this, you're going to obviously need your transmitter, FRSky QX7, the transistor mod, a soldering iron of some type, wire cutters, uh, four pieces of wire at least four inches long, not pictured, double-sided sticky tape, and a Phillips head screwdriver. Okay, so you're going to start by turning over your transmitter. Keep your gimbal protectors on. It'll uh, help in the future. Then take off the battery cover and remove the battery. And once you've taken out the battery, you can go ahead and take your Phillips head screwdriver and remove these four screws that are marked with the red in the photo. And after you remove those screws, go ahead and pull the cover off on the back. And uh, when you're finished staring at the chaos, go ahead and remove the eight screws on the lower circuit board marked by red. So now that you have those screws out, go ahead and pull up on that board gently. The knob is going to pop off on the front and uh, locate the Q400 transistor. You're going to want to take this off with pliers and soldering iron. And then once you've cleaned it up, go ahead and put the input wire onto the single side of the transistor. And you'll see that there's one side that's one and one side with two. Okay, so once you're satisfied with your solder job, go ahead and put the circuit board back down, reinstall the eight screws, and re-secure uh, the vibe in the corner of the transmitter platform. Also, as you can see here, I went ahead and put the double-sided sticky tape on the back of the processor, like everyone else. Now, using something that can hold it in place, it's time to go ahead and pre-tin the transistor. It's always a good idea to pre-tin everything. Okay, now it's time to go ahead and solder in the other three wires. Uh, the green wire is the output, I believe, and then the black and red goes on the actual capacitor pads, not the little circular pads next to them. At the end of the video, I'll be providing wiring diagrams from TBS. Alright, here, here is the final product of uh, the wiring, and the green is actually the in and the white is the output on the new transistor mod. And like before, you're going to want to put the case back back on and then insert the four screws and tighten them down and reinstall your battery. That's an important part. And then uh, put the cover back on and connect your TBS module. And as promised, here is the wiring pinout diagram from the TBS website. Uh, it was originally posted, I suppose, by rctech.de. And uh, it gives kind of a more clear layout of the schematics and what all needs to happen. So this has been a tech moment from Ritty FPV for Get FPV. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you learned something. And uh, see you soon.